these bad, uh, let's call them, like they're called senescent cells. They've been damaged mm -hmm. and our body has tried to repair them, okay. but let's say it can't. It's, yeah. it's too damaged. Right. Not damaged enough like that sunburn where it just dies and is flushed out of your system. Got it. it and it's not fixed, so it's just sitting there. And it's not helping anything. Kind of like it's dormant. making things worse. Mm. It's because things are seen like this is a problem cell, you know, and you can't fix it. And it, it like starts a like cascade of events yeah, of negative events. Does a problem cell attract more problem cells? I believe it does. Okay. I believe it does. Just curious. I like believe if it does. It would just start multiplying or attracting other oh, oh, the damage. groups of those yeah. cells could come together. And well, what's going to happen when you have groups of those cells or even a couple of single cells? I mean, that's where you're getting the the pigmentation yeah. and the wrinkles and... Loss of elasticity. You know, definitely loss mm -hmm. of elasticity. Yeah. So what we want to do is we want to get rid of those cells. Unfortunately, because the DNA repair enzymes mm -hmm. of our body tried to fix it but couldn't, Okay. even putting on more, we still can't fix it. But what we can do is help it go away <laughs> help it flush out of the system and yeah. help get rid of it it's like we can't fix you but we can get you out of the body right right and you know replace and it with nice new healthy is going cells. to help flush that damage yeah dna as well? repair enzymes are what can do that 